In this question, an incident wave is moving to the right and reflected from a hard surface. Eventually, right, we get a standing wave. The question asks, right, which position is most likely a node of the resultant standing wave? So you see, this is actually the wave profile of the incident wave. And the wave is like constantly moving, right? Okay, this is only at one instant in time. The next instant, you don't know already. So you see, how are you supposed to go and figure out what is the, um, where is the node? Are you going to draw a reflected wave and then uh, do your own superposition here to find the resultant? Uh, actually, no. Okay. The only thing that you need to know here is the wave reflects off a hard surface. So at the position of the wall, okay, the resultant wave right, will definitely be a node here. Okay, which is like this. So where will all the other nodes be found? They will all be found at multiples of lambda upon 2 away from the wall. So how we use this wave profile right, of the incident wave is use it to find what is lambda. Take the ruler, measure on the diagram. So after you know what is lambda, you know what is lambda over 2. Then right, from the wall, mark out all the positions corresponding to multiples of lambda upon 2. So uh, once you've done that, you'll know that answer will be C.